all the theoretical and uh, let me say uh, the approaches which we hear over here, I think it's also necessary to come to the pragmatics of companies. After all, export promotion, if it is done in a proper way, it's to the success of the companies and in return by the taxes on turnover to the public. This is why export promotion has to be defined definitely to the needs of the companies themselves. If we talk about export markets, we have to analyze the markets, we have to profile the markets and make them accessible for companies. This is the major challenge we are facing. We, uh, this has to be done in a cooperation of government bodies and industry. That means a private public duty. In that one, it is necessary that the di diplomatic service, like the DPR, that they play their role as they did so far in the last 50 years. But also the associations defining which companies are the ones you should bring to markets abroad and to prepare them, uh, them within Brasilia. This is very of very much importance. At the same time, it is necessary to have an infrastructure available in the, in the markets themselves where you want to go to really guide the companies to the right partners over there. The last is the most difficult task. If we leave it to the embassies alone, if we leave it to the diplomatics alone, that's not sufficient. We have to enlarge the number of persons involved in the, the markets abroad to make successful pre-arrangement of meetings, pre-arrangement of business and guide the companies and accompany them in the markets. This is what we had to uh, challenge in the last 20, 30 years in Germany. We are still in the process of optimizing it, but the success gives us right. They prove that if the companies are satisfied, if the companies save time in entering the markets, if the companies increase their export, after all, the government, the public will benefit from it because we found out that the expenses spent on export promotion came back through the taxes on extra turnover the companies generated abroad.